Protecting land. Tonight, more than 600 acres of land is now owned by a local nonprofit. The goal is to ultimately protect wildlife, but they say they need help from you. Yeah, These there's very few natural alluvial fans left, so that would have been very sad. But more importantly, the migration uh, pass of the animals that come through would have been disturbed. This area in Indio Hills was slated for development, but is now being protected. The 639 acres of land was purchased by Oswit Land Trust for $4 million, with grants from U.S. Fish and Wildlife, with the goal of preserving it. It has uh, a lot of significance to it. It's a undisturbed alluvial fan, and uh, alluvial fan is like all that water from the top of the mountains comes down and it brings with it a lot of nutrients and everything, and it spreads out on the floor. All that nutrients has made this an ideal place for local vegetation to thrive and provide food and shelter for a number of different animals, including one at risk of extinction. You know, we have some amazing wildlife that we need to look out for, and one of them is the uh, desert tortoise, and they've been spotted out there, and we'll start uh, helping that endangered species to thrive. But all this work can't be done alone. The group is asking the community for donations to cover expenses not covered by the grants, including environmental studies and closing costs. That And that money we put out, and that total on that was $25,000. And uh, boy, we'd love to have an angel step up and just help us with that. And for Aaron Leader from Oswit, it makes him hopeful about the work he's doing to save the desert ecosystems of the Coachella Valley, one acre at a time. It's just exciting, you know, in, in, the, in the hustle and bustle of the world with everything that's happening right now. It's just wonderful to do um, another acquisition for us with Land Trust. It's and live out here just behind me, you can take a look at just how extensive and beautiful this area looks right now. Acres and acres of vegetation and mountains right there in the distance. Now, according to their website, the group has saved in total more than a thousand different species and more than 5,000 acres of land. For more information and ways you can help, visit our website, kesq.com. Here live in Indio Hills, Luis Avila, News Channel 3.